Hey YouTube, this is super awesome. Three, two, one, seven, four. And today I'm going to show you how to SSH into your iPod Touch slash iPhone slash iPhone 3G with 2.2 firmware. If your iPod has to be jailbroken, your iPhone, whatever. Okay, so I'm just going to get right into it. I'm going to explain the computer part later. Okay, I'm going to get right into it. So the first thing you do, go ahead and go to Cydia. And I'll put these two apps in the description. Sorry, I'm just trying to exit out all these pop-ups in the beginning of my computer. I'll tell you when this comes on. Okay, so once this is on, what you want to do is first go to search. Mine's like freezing. There you go. Search, and you're going to type in B O S S. P R. Yeah, you might already have it. Uh, that's it right there. Boss, boss prefs. So go ahead and, oh, crap. Go ahead and click on that. And once you get that, go ahead and download that one. And the most important one. There it is right there. Open SSH. And we're going to put those in the description. Okay. So once you've downloaded that and that, you're going to go ahead and go to Boss Press, and that's what that looks like. It's going to say Analyzing Services. And you're going to go ahead and see where it says SSH. you got to turn that on. On. There it goes. Okay. And... You're really done with this part. What you might want to do to save battery life, uh, go ahead and just put it in lock mode. And there goes Jake's iPhone, which I'm going to get. I'm getting an iPhone finally. Okay. So let me move this on over to the computer and show you this part. Oh, I'm going to go ahead and put it on unregistered hypercam. Okay, so here's the here's what you do. You go ahead and go on to your internet internet service. Sorry this mic is so crappy. I mean it's from guitar here and I just plug it in. Once it's over you're gonna go ahead and go to Google. And you're gonna click in Ring The first one, always. And what you're going to do here is you're going to right click and click download file. And now go ahead and save it. Take off. Go. That out. You can go ahead and ask this one to that out. Now you just right click on it and you just click open. Oh, you don't have to do that. Do that. Double click on it. Click on it. Now, if you have this then it will just stay up. Push, push. And then 
go ahead and do that. And just click no, I'll restart the video later. And go ahead and do that. Now, I'm pretty sure I already have one, so I'm wondering if that would be safe. Yeah, there we go. Okay? And you should have, you shouldn't have anything here. What you want to do is go get a new. And how to get this is you go on your iPod or and then you're going to click um, Wi-Fi. And right next to the name of the Wi-Fi you have, you'll have a blue arrow. Go ahead and click on that. It will tell you your IP address. And use that as the host name. So that's my host name. You're all, you just going to put a quick like this. Like this. Your username, I'm going to put this in the description. Group. Password. All time. I have no idea what you are. And save. Uh, I'm not going to save this. If you do that, yeah, that's it. And. So I'm just going to have to close it. Okay. So I'm going to see if I'm working. Okay, well this one apparent oh, yeah. Okay, it's gonna say searching for host, connecting the host, um, option six three, username root. What you're gonna type in is L time again. And there you go. There you have it. Remember guys I showed you this is two point two. And that's it.